Okay, and he keeps turning, he keeps turning, he keeps turning. He ends up here. He just got to this position, okay, and we're playing a leg lock game. Before he can solidify the position of putting his arm under my head and shoving me down with the cradle, which we were doing last week, so he's going to be putting me here and squishing me together, or even cross-facing and holding me, okay, his goal is to prevent me from getting access to the leg. But if he just landed here, right, we have access to the legs. So one of the easier setups we can do is I'm going to start just pulling underneath of our partner. Okay, we're not going to go for anything fancy here. We're just going to hail Mary this. So I'm just going to be underneath and I'm grabbing this leg. When I grab this leg and I'm stacking myself up, look how I'm turning. It's a bit of a hard mechanic to explain, but when I'm pulling the foot, I'm then looking and I'm keeping my head bridged to the mat. And then from here, I can get access to the leg. And I keep going over the fact that you guys have to keep your head to the mat when you're turning. Mechanically, you're much stronger. So if we go back to that single X, okay, let's break this down really slowly. That he's passing, he keeps turning, and I'm watching him. Right away, I'm making my structure small. I'm pinning my head to the mat and I'm turning his leg. It's gonna dump him and I'm holding down to the lever. From here, I keep hipping out and I'm watching that heel. And from here, we get access to the heel up. Now you can try and move your feet wherever you want, but I like to get in the habit of gas pedaling. Because from here, when I'm gas pedaling, I'm putting pressure on my foot, it's squishing his leg down, but it's also helping me lift his knee as I bridge back. Okay, so without even properly attacking the heel hook, you can see he's going to tap in that scenario. Versus if I try and lift, it's tight, but now I actually have to connect my grip and bridge in more versus here. Okay, so again, you with your partner. Okay, go slow on these drills, guys. It's here, he's clearing. Right away, it says reactionary. We're here, we're getting underneath the foot. We're pulling the foot. And as I'm pulling him, I'm extending my leg. I'm pushing him back. I'm turning myself to the other hip. So I'm on one hip, I'm turning to the other hip, and I'm accessing the heel by reaching back, and I'm stomping my feet together. My knees are always pinned to the mat. Here is okay, but it's not great. He can maybe pummel, I want to say maybe, maybe pummel to the inside position on either side. But if I stomp and keep my knees stuck to the mat, it's easier for me to reach. Okay guys, last time. So, if you guys are here, you shoot this guard, he goes to pass right away, you swipe him over, you think you're going underneath, you're hail marrying it, you're turning, you're hipping out to the other side, and I'm reaching, extending the lever, and breaking.